Hey everybody, Billy from Mutation Creation. Uh, today we're going to do an update on a clutch and, and cut two. Nothing super exciting, but uh, you know, egg cutting, you'll see. Hopefully I hit the odds and uh, we'll go from there. First what we're going to do is, um, I just want to get in, I, I don't know if anyone's seen already, but I have a Patreon account. Uh, you go to patreon.com and, and, go, and, and search Mutation Creation Canada. I put up a couple things. Uh, one is a video of assist feeding. Um, it's up there, you can see it, view it for free. Uh, take a peek, hopefully it helps. I know it's something that uh, people um, are sort of afraid to do, but I do think it's necessary, and, and this is the way I do mine. So I just hope it helps, and if you look at it, um, check it out, and uh, hopefully, um, if you have to do it, um, it, it helps you do it the way I do and get your animal back to health. Uh, that being said, let's get in. This was a banana het pied to a banana pied. Eight eggs, and I got really good, uh, really good results. You see, they all want to get out at the same time. So, I hit one super banana pied, and that's a male. So, he's going to be staying here and, and, and get a lot of breeding done in the future with the ladies. Really nice color. And... I also was able to hit a banana pied female and also a banana pied male. So big difference in contrast between the banana pied and the super banana pied. Of course they're taking the show away from the super banana pied. So I'll put one on either side so you can see. Now these will color up, these will color down and this will get a little different in color when they get a little bigger and after a few more sheds. I was also lucky enough to hit two super banana pet pides and a 1.1 banana hep pied. So I'm just gonna pile these things up like a traffic jam and and one hep pied female. So, really good odds, really good diversity. Hoping for a, a super banana female pied, but I'm, I'm happy nonetheless. So, really good update. They're doing well. They've already had a meal, a meal. So, I just wanted to give you guys an update on them. My super banana pied. So, pretty good odds, really happy with that. Now speaking of odds, I have here a pastel Mojave het pied female to a special het pied female. So, uh, five eggs, and if you notice one's already gone bad. Growing some all types of different colored fungus or mold or whatever you want to call it. So we're just gonna discard that. It's nice and hard. Someone asked me in one of the other videos when I threw the eggs out, if, um, if I check the ones that were moldy, um, I usually do, but one that's this hard, there's no fluid, there's no sense opening it. Because if you do open it, uh, it's gonna be nasty looking and also smell pretty bad. So, out of these four eggs, I'm hoping to hit at least one visual. Pastel Special Pied, is, is what I'm going after. So, start with egg number one. I'm really happy to work with the special gene. I've been working with it since 2011 when I brought the pastel crystal male into Canada. Now, having the special gene in the pied and seeing what the guys over in Europe have been doing with it, uh, it's just amazing. So I ended up getting a couple special pied, male and female, They'll be breeding this year, but I have a special hepied male that's been breeding. And first egg, pastel, maybe pastel special. Pastel Mojave, maybe. We'll see, every one of these eggs will be 66% hepied because of the head-to-head -head pairing. So, 
hopefully I'm hitting my visual. I could also hit a crystal pied, pastel crystal pied. Let's see, egg number two. Pastavi, 66% tet pied. Two eggs down, two to go. Could be Mojave Pied. I don't know if it's crystal. Just trying to look. Actually, no, now I see some pattern. That'll be a crystal. Maybe even a pastel crystal. If you notice, see that's the belly I was looking at with all white, but now if I just see, see a little bit of pattern here. So that's a crystal or a pastel crystal, 66% had pied. And down to one egg. Happy I at least got a crystal so far. I love crystals. I like the way they color up and age as adults. Good thing about having a, a crystal. It's a super form. Or acts like super. So whatever comes out has to be either a Mojave or a special. No normals can be produced. Which is always a good thing. And last one. No pied. That's alright. That one looks like a pastel, maybe a pastel special, 66% head pied. So, not the greatest odds on this clutch, but happy nonetheless. Put this one aside. Move this here. Let's clean up. The next one I'm a little excited about. I have five eggs from what I believe is an asphalt female. I'm pretty sure she's uh, hopefully she'll prove out this year um, to a pastel leopard ivory. So. You've seen me hit the pastel leopard uh, freeway as well as leopard freeways. Um, hopefully uh, she is an asphalt so I can hit some more because they're just amazing. Five eggs. Let's see if uh, the odds here make up for the last one. Pastel, definitely yellow belly. Because it's an ivory, when I don't hit a freeway, everything will be yellow belly. Really hope to see a freeway. Freeway! So, that asphalt is definitely an asphalt. 
no leopard in here so that's either a freeway or could be a pastel freeway but it looks a little too dark so that's good so at least that female that I purchased as an asphalt is an actual asphalt so very happy there that she proved out nothing like having uh, more breeder female asphalts egg number three let's see some leopard freeways Oh, yellow belly. At least give me a leopard yellow belly. Come on now. It's another thing I need more of. Some leopard yellow belly stuff. And there we go, Leopard Freeway and Pastel to boot. So, Pastel Leopard Freeway. That's awesome. So, two freeways out of four eggs. Let me push my luck and get one more on the fifth. Let's see. I have to use the little one. That is a pass. Pastel Leopard Yellow Belly. Really cool. So hopefully that's a female. Actually, I hope, I'm all, I hope they all are females. You know how we can never get enough females. So super happy. super happy like I said can't go wrong um, hopefully they're all females but if not uh, I'm, I'm happy regardless um, hope you liked the video I know it was a little long nothing super super exciting but I'd rather put some content up and, and say hi to you guys and, and hopefully it was exciting um, I'll give you guys some more updates down the road and uh, I don't know a couple more days end of the week I'll put another video up cutting some updates etc etc so I'm going to leave some of the comments, sorry, some of the, uh, in the description, I'm going to leave some, um, uh, whatever, I, I, I'm, I'm all over the place right now. Um, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and uh, see you next video.